Section. Introduction. In this section, we explore the idea that understanding the reasons behind statements in a text is crucial for a deeper comprehension. This concept applies to language models, LMs, as well, across various tasks like reasoning and programming. Previous studies have shown that LMs perform better when they can predict future text based on the implications of the current text. However, existing methods focus on specific tasks or sets of tasks, limiting the LM's ability to learn reasoning from all types of text. We introduce the concept of teaching LMs to reason through language modeling itself. The self-taught reasoner, STAR, demonstrated that LMs can enhance their reasoning skills by answering questions and learning from their reasoning process. However, relying solely on curated question-answering datasets restricts the range of reasoning tasks the LM can learn from. Instead, we propose Quiet Star, where the LM generates explanations for future text after each word, improving its ability to predict text. By training the LM to think before predicting, we enable it to learn reasoning from a diverse range of tasks present in language. Quiet Star is applied to Mistral 7b using web text datasets, resulting in improved reasoning abilities without specific fine tuning. We extend STAR by training the LM to generate reasoning from unstructured text data, a novel approach compared to previous works focusing on specific reasoning tasks. Our training algorithm is scalable and generates rationales for all token positions in a text string. We introduce meta tokens to guide the LM in generating rationales and predictions. By retrospectively adjusting predictions based on generated rationales, we enhance the LM's ability to predict challenging tokens. Our approach demonstrates that training LMs to reason from text leads to better predictions, especially with longer reasoning sequences. Previous works have shown the importance of reasoning in LMs for various tasks, but our method stands out by training LMs to reason from diverse text data rather than predefined tasks. Section Summary In this section, we introduce the concept that understanding the implicit reasoning behind text can significantly enhance language model LM, performance across various tasks. We propose Quiet Star, a method that trains LMs to generate reasoning to infer future text from unstructured data, leading to improved zero-shot direct reasoning abilities without dataset-specific fine-tuning. By leveraging the LM's pre-existing reasoning ability to generate rationales and training it with a reinforce-based reward, we enable the model to think before making predictions, resulting in better token predictions with longer thoughts. Section. Training language models to reason. In this section, we explore how researchers have trained language models to improve reasoning skills. One approach involves training the model on mind reasoning data, but this method has limitations such as requiring manual annotation and being costly to scale. Another direction focuses on the language model generating its own reasoning, which has shown promise in solving increasingly difficult problems. We also discuss the use of meta tokens, which are custom tokens optimized for specific functions within a neural network. These tokens have been beneficial in tasks like prompt tuning and context compression. Our work introduces an auxiliary rationale variable between observed tokens to optimize the language model's ability to generate intermediate thoughts for better reasoning. Our goal is to enhance the language model's performance by incorporating intermediate rationales between tokens in the sequence. This helps the model break down complex computations into smaller steps, improving its predictive capabilities. We outline the three main steps of our approach, Quiet Star, which involve parallel rationale generation, mixing post-rationale and base predictions, and optimizing rationale generation to enhance future text prediction. Section Summary In this section, we explore training language models to reason by either using mind reasoning traces or relying on a language model's own generated reasoning. The former approach involves drawbacks like manual annotation and scalability issues, while the latter, demonstrated by methods like self-taught reasoner, shows promise in solving increasingly difficult problems iteratively. Additionally, recent work has focused on introducing custom tokens, such as function vectors, to optimize specific functions within neural networks, 
enhancing performance in tasks like compression and attention control. Section. Parallel Generation. In this section, we tackle the challenge of efficiently generating rationales at each token position in the input sequence. Initially, we faced the issue of needing a separate forward pass for each token, which would be computationally impractical for long sequences. To address this, we devised a method for highly parallel generation by leveraging the probability distribution generated by a language model for all input tokens. This approach allows us to sample one next token from each input token simultaneously. When generating a successor for each token, we encountered a scenario where continuing with the original sequence was not straightforward. For instance, predicting the next token after each word in the sequence, the cat set, could result in a list of tokens that do not form a coherent continuation. However, we found a way to use these generated successors to extract hidden thoughts for each observed token efficiently. To achieve this, we cached each forward pass and incorporated a diagonal attention mask to the previous one. This modification ensured that each generated token attends not only to the tokens used to generate it but also to itself, excluding tokens from other potential continuations. Additionally, this parallelized token sampling process could be repeated multiple times, enhancing the generation process. To address the issue of thoughts initially being out of distribution and affecting language modeling performance, we introduced a learned interpolation mechanism between LM predictions with and without thoughts. This interpolation, facilitated by a mixing head, determines the influence of post-thought predictions on the overall output. We utilized a shallow multi-layer perceptron for this purpose and provided detailed implementation specifics in the appendix. The less than start of thought, greater than, and less than, end of thought, greater than tokens play a crucial role in controlling the rationale generation process. Optimizing the representation of these tokens, especially the less than, start of thought, greater than, token, is challenging due to the discrete nature of rationale tokens. We initialized these token embeddings to leverage the existing knowledge of the language model and expedited their optimization by applying a weight to their gradients during updates. In our approach, we aim to ensure that the model's reward depends more on the semantic content following a thought rather than the exact next word in the text. To achieve this, we employed a teacher forcing technique and non myopic scoring, considering future tokens' probabilities based on the end thought token and previous observed token. This strategy helped in training the model to generate more useful rationales over time. We utilized the reinforce algorithm to optimize the likelihood of rationales based on their utility. By defining a reward for each rationale and incorporating it into the loss function, we encouraged the model to generate rationales that enhance its predictions of future tokens. This iterative optimization process, along with log likelihood loss, ensured that the model learned to generate more informative rationales throughout training. Section Summary In this section, we efficiently tackle the challenge of generating rationales at each token position in the input sequence by enabling highly parallel generation. By leveraging a language model's inference pass to produce a probability distribution over next tokens for all input tokens, we can sample one next token from each input token simultaneously. This parallelized approach allows for the generation of hidden thoughts for each observed token efficiently, enhancing the model's rationale generation process. Section. Experiments and results. In this section, we conducted experiments to explore the impact of our quiet star approach on language models. We observed that not all words require the same level of thinking for prediction accuracy. Our experiments focused on determining if quiet star is beneficial for predicting tokens that do need thoughtful consideration. We tested our approach on datasets that require reasoning skills and found that quiet star improved the model's ability to predict answers, especially on technical web pages. We also saw positive effects on more diverse text datasets, although to a lesser extent. When evaluating the zero-shot reasoning capabilities of the language model on Common Sense QA and GSM 8K, we found that QuietStar significantly enhanced performance. On Common Sense QA, 
we saw a 10.9% improvement over the base model, and on GSM 8K, there was a 5.0% boost. The length of the rationales generated during quiet star training directly correlated with improved performance on both tasks. Our experiments showed that longer rationales led to better results, indicating that quiet star effectively teaches the model to use its own generated thoughts for more thorough reasoning. Compared to a similar approach called pause tokens, Quiet Star outperformed in enhancing the model's reasoning capabilities. We did not fine tune on downstream tasks, yet our results demonstrate that training a language model to understand implicit information in text data can enhance its reasoning abilities across various tasks. Furthermore, our analysis revealed that while there was little overall improvement in predicting all tokens, there was a significant enhancement in predicting more challenging tokens. Tokens requiring the recall of specific information, like theorem names or proof steps, benefited the most from thoughtful consideration. This aligns with the idea that careful thinking is particularly helpful for certain types of tokens. Section Summary In this section, we explore the impact of Quiet Star on language models' reasoning abilities. We observe that not all tokens benefit equally from additional thought, with our experiments showing that Quiet Star improves performance on datasets requiring reasoning, such as Common Sense QA and GSM 8K. Longer rationales generated during Quiet Star training lead to better question answering performance, surpassing the results of a constrained pause token approach. This suggests that training models to predict subtext in text data enhances their reasoning capabilities, especially on challenging tokens that require deeper understanding. Section. Handling Instability. In this section, we encountered challenges related to handling instability in our task. One major issue we faced was the potential instability introduced by the mapping from generated thoughts to language prediction. Even if a generated thought could perfectly predict the next token, it might not provide any signal if the weight on that generation was zero. We tried using the Gumbel softmax trick with a straight-through estimator to address this, but faced vanishing gradients with multiple softmax operations. Dealing with the exploration-exploitation trade-off, a key issue in reinforcement learning, was another challenge. Traditional approaches like DQN, PPO, and A3C resolve these trade-offs by learning a state value function to estimate future rewards. However, the reward functions in our environment were unstable due to the changing mixing heads, leading to unsatisfactory results with these techniques. We also noted the complexity introduced by the need for the rationale to not harm the base model performance. The more complex the mapping from language model output to next token prediction, the more instability we observed. When we trained without any interpolation, removing the mixing head and only using the language model prediction after thoughts, the model learned to ignore the thoughts, resulting in no generalization to downstream tasks. Exploring the use of separate heads for thinking and talking, we tried linear layers and MLPs initialized to contribute minimally to the base language model outputs. However, instability prevented learning in all cases. We aimed to minimize components transforming the language model's outputs, with or without rationales. Our choice to use a language model to output a weight combining multiple states, similar to an attention mechanism, allowed the model to attend to its thinking. While our approach faced challenges, such as the need for simplifications and limitations in training, it offers a new framework for learning to reason and addresses various meta-learning challenges. Further research is needed to explore the full potential of these techniques, especially when applied to more advanced models.